What is going on, everybody? It is the Misfit Bear, and welcome back to another reaction. We got the latest video from Sensei, and it's called Pain and the Six Paths of Jumping. Now, I'm a little bit confused about the title, but in Naruto, there is a lot of running. There is a lot of jumping, and I believe I know... I, I might know what it's what the title is talking about, but I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I literally just finished uh, Crisis 3 Remastered not too long ago. And man, that was such a wild ride. The ending was great. I cannot wait for Crisis 4. I'm going to definitely, you know, do some more reaction videos, try to get more of those out since that content definitely helps. And, and I know you guys enjoy it, but I'm not going to over talk it. You know, let's. Let's see what this uh let's see what this video is about. I, I believe it's a Black Force energy one for pain, but I'm not entirely sure. But hey, let's see. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. A beautiful day in the neighborhood. <laughs> God, I love the Leaf Village. So, I mean, yeah, the Leaf Village is cool, man. It's a lot of <laughs> I remember that guy get, you know I'm from like, One Piece. And all that. I mean, I'm popping popper with it. You feel me? I, I just moved here not too long ago, but it really popping with a nigga, so. Right. Yeah, but it's deeper than that. I mean, the people are great, and it's just so beautiful. It, wait, what? what is that? You see that? Hold on, what? I can't really see the sun in a way. Let me... Oh my God! This is oh, oh this a nigga floating right now in the leaf oh, village. Oh, like, that was such an iconic scene. Yeah, bro. Like he got this drippy ass robe on and oh carrot my top here. But there's definitely a nigga up there. And now, the world shall know. Wait, what did he say? Hey, <laughs> hey, nigga. Hey, what you say? I said, and now the world shall know. Oh my the world God! Shall know. So no know what? what? Hold on, let me get closer. I can't hear this nigga. All right, bro. I climbed up on this building. What did you say? <laughs> I said, and now the world oh, shall know. Almighty push. Oh my God, nigga. Yes. What are you doing right now? You posing? Orochimaru oh, shit, nigga. What, what, what brought what two oh, different villages with him. <laughs> And pain oh God, did nigga, ten times more that? That, in oh literally God, half the time. Just destroyed the whole just that shit here, was nigga. nuts when See, I this first saw it. To the cloud village, man. I should have stayed with my niggas, bro. <laughs> right? There's a bunch of niggas over there. I came here with these white people and shit. These Japanese and all that. And now they, yep. cloud village is literally board. where all man, the somebody got a document there or something like that. This is crazy. I got you. I got you. Oh my God, yo. I ain't yeah. gonna lie to y'all, yo, but y'all heard the intro, man. Oh my God, yo. You know exactly what we're here today yes. for. Who to talk about? We are here to talk about the six paths the six of pain. Paths of pain. Oh my God, bro. The way that this nigga pain violated the Leaf Village. <sighs> Man, this on is another for the level books. yo so first and foremost before we even go anywhere near what happened at the leaf village though we have to talk Jiraiya. about my nigga jiraiya real quick because oh my god bro this is the first Legendary time Sunny. i have ever seen an anime the fight back nigga fight back that, that meme was inspired by this moment i bro. There's still no have way to watch jujutsu kaisen because this nigga jiraiya I still have to pull to. up to one of his old students i think i'm on like episode Nagato. two of the and first I'm not gonna season lie, yo, when i first see him pull up i was like yo it's no way that this nigga's about to get punished yo because it's big jiraiya big jiraiya so this old ass frog nigga pulls up. He got all the toads with him and all that. And he has oh, this yeah. conversation with Nagato, bro. And all of a sudden, these carrot top, these orange head ass niggas come out of the woodworks, bro, with these Akatsuki robes on, bro. Yep. Now, I ain't gonna lie, bro. The choco that the Akatsuki robes has on our black anime cosplay oh, community yes. is crazy. So like, many like, people. I'm gonna need y'all to, like, switch into some other cosplays, bro. Like, dress up <laughs> like an Espada member or something. Like, I mean, like, like, hey, like, them like robes is Amber, clean. Like, something, bro. Like, if I see one more Akatsuki cosplay, Those Espada robes are clean. <laughs> so I need man, to get Ryan one. pulls up, bro, and he instantly realizes that there's a lot of niggas here, bro. Like, 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 like a lot of them. And they instantly get the scrapping, bro. My man goes straight into Sage Mode. Now, I ain't gonna yeah. lie to you. His sage mode was a little bit different than Naruto's because Naruto couldn't combine with the two toes, mom, pa, because of the QB chakra. Sage you feel mode me? But my master. man Jiraiya could. So this man Jiraiya turns into an actual toad. I'm not gonna lie, yo. It was kind of clean. Like, I'm gonna come all the way clean. But, but he was on all fours at one point. And I was like, yo, this man really a Yeah, it was like, interesting. All that. It was, so the, now it was like the real time that Jiraiya yo, got to turn out his hair. power. Like, can we talk about how he got this bell pepper on his face and all these <laughs> bumps? Like, bro, I'm, Right, warts. I mean, it makes sense. Frogs you know how they be like, yo, frogs will give you warts and stuff. See? Oh, so the car is just going to chill in the background. So, Carcoon has just been coming back to my videos lately. That's just. 
<sighs> oh, did a car go by? Maybe it's because I switched my schedule around and I'm actually recording during the day. But, but that's even the order. That my makes a lot of sense. Yo, you know, they be saying frogs be giving niggas warts and all that. Well, they done did it to my man Jirai. He all bumpy face and all that. But he get to scrapping with his student. Well, his former students. You feel me? Yahiko. You feel me? Mm. That dead body ends up turning Naruto into Naruto look alike. Pains. We got Nagato. Well, we ain't really get to see Nagato till mad later. But he's like sick an actual all that. Uzumaki. Got, uh, the angel bitch. Oh, Conan. Oh, I forgot her name, bro. I know I sound like real misogynist right now because I forgot a woman's name, but I promise you that I am. I mean, I'm not. <laughs> but nah, nah, I'm just playing. But nah, we got the angel bitch yeah, with and all that. So they get to scrapping, bro. And I, I thought her ability was, was so really interesting. Doing his thing. Like, maybe if he knew that the, there was going to be six the of these people initially, he would have did better, bro. Because like initially he was just fighting like three of them. And he was doing his thing, but th their eyes are all synced up. One of yep. them could absorb chakra. There's another Lame. one that does like summoning jusus. They out here summoning Too dogs, much. birds, all that. Their like, powers they got a pet shop. Like one, one of these, the bitch that another be level. Shit, she a zoologist. Like she be out here making some some crazy she, shit. Like, three headed summon like dogs, three or four things at one time. This freaking ass, nuts. Two can Sam ass bird. Like bro, she be going crazy. So after a while of Jiraiya getting punished, him, mom, pa come up with his idea to yep. use his genjutsu. The frog now, this song. This genjutsu is fire, bro, because it basically locks down your nervous system and makes it so you can't move. He ends up doing this and he kills, or so he thinks, three of these like dolls. I'm trying to now figure out where lie, he yo, got the damn swords got really from. Wicked. And I'm talking real demon time, bro. Because this man, Jiraiya, walks outside thinking that he's accomplished his goal just to be greeted by three of the people that regenerated nope. that he thought he killed. And then three others. This is when he realizes there's six of these niggas. You remember that infamous meme where he writes on Pa's back and code for Naruto? And it's like, this nigga is six people, yes. bro. This nigga <laughs> is six niggas, bro. The six paths of Black Air Force energy. Nigga, this yeah. nigga is different. So once the main pain comes around, I realize that this he man Jiraiya is just completely outmatched. Whoops. He ends up taking one of them out. I'm not going to lie, which is kind of impressive. But that bitch ends up getting replaced when Naruto fights him anyway. So it doesn't really matter. Yeah. However, it did matter for the Leaf Villains because they needed that shit to get information. Now, I think the saddest part of this whole part of the arc is, you know, Jiraiya's untimely death. They literally beat the shit out of this nigga. They and then they really start did. stabbing him with these big ass black rods. Yeah, just, I didn't know if that I was, was watching Jiraiya die or some white shit get penetrated on Pornhub because they oh put six rods God. in his back. This oh man Jiraiya on the God. ground like, yo, down bad. But somehow finds the strength to get up for a minute to write that message on yep, the frog's back. Now, I'm going to translate what these numbers mean on the back. Because they tell you it's about, like, Jiraiya telling them, you know, not to give up and all of that shit. Oh, nah, nah, no. nah, this is what this nigga was writing. <clears throat> Dear Naruto, oh, if you're no. reading this message, then you realize that your master Jiraiya has gotten punished by six niggas. <laughs> now you're probably training to become a sage and have sage mode chakra, but right. nigga, you're gonna need more than that. Right. Because I'm a master of this shit, and I still got Look punished. At the I don't really know, you know what's going on right now. I'm kind of going in and out of consciousness. <laughs> One minute I was thinking about a bad bitch, but then I was like, hold on, I gotta write my man Naruto, so here I am. Oh, you know, my it's a cold, God. cold world out here, little nigga. And you're gonna have to face oh these six people God. yourself. But don't worry. You can very I vaguely the see the meme prophecy. in the background. At least I think so. I don't know if it was Minato, Nagato, or you. It's one of y'all niggas. One of you. Lie. Like one of y'all niggas. Whoever wins. If you're me, I, I mean, right. my bad, my bad. My bad. <clears throat> I lost my accent for a minute. Uh, but Naruto, I love you. Always remember that. Uh, and also, uh, oh don't tell God. anybody about my nudie magazine stash nudie that's in magazines. the chest underneath where we used to train at. You can look at them, but don't tell anybody about it. Especially Shunai. Because I'm like, when she comes to the afterlife, I'm still trying to crack that. Anyways, <laughs> P.S. Naruto, this nigga is six niggas, by the way, if you haven't realized. Right at oh, the very also, end, he told him. Different. Also, your QB chakra probably isn't even going to save you. Also, this nigga is kind of drippy for real. You might need to take some lessons. But right. Naruto. If you cried, leave a comment. That's what the writer said. And I ain't gonna lie to y'all, bro. My man Kishimoto told me himself. So at this point, Jiraiya is <laughs> going out for the count, bro. And I was like, okay, well, maybe they'll have a little bit of a reprieve while Naruto man. trains. But I was wrong, bro. Because as soon as Naruto starts training, this man Pain gets the idea of, well, go to the Leaf go Village. Show the Leaf Village Pain. And if you recall from my intro, this is the part of the story where this man Pain literally Goes used guerrilla to tactics to work. infiltrate the Leaf Village. And when I say he bodies literally everybody, everybody. there, everybody. The people that weren't there. You feel me? Because my nigga Six guy was not people. there. Yo, my nigga guy Versus was there. Versus an Yo, entire village. Guy, me, but that's neither here nor there. These niggas go into the Leaf Village and start bodying they everybody. They go Jones, ham. Chunis, babies, kids, pets. It do not matter. These niggas are smoking shit. Each of them have like specific things I want to talk about, bro. The one big nigga that absorbs chakra, but when you first see him, as soon as you see him, two ninjas run up to him, and this man grabs both of them by the throat and hits yeah. these niggas with the meanest chokes. I couldn't find the scene to just pretend life. this is them. Boom, 
slams the shit out of these niggas. I didn't know hey, it's a classic show. scene. King, Undertaker, I don't know who that That's a classic the scene. Slams the shit out of these niggas. Yeah. Bro, there was one time, yo, with uh, the one ninja with the scar on his face. Epi he Zoo. was in Genjutsu where it's like a torture chamber. And he was like basically giving pain no, not and enduring pain. Epizu, what the? Wait, hold on. Uh, is that? No, it can't be. EBK. I think that's what his name was. EBK. To like try to get answers from this person. I guess it's some sort of like interrogation juice. Yeah, he's I don't know the if that interrogator. Nigga is be the first 48 or not. But he might need that's crazy. But, anyways, he realizes this doll feels no pain. He's Ebi like, oh, this bitch ain't even feeling this shit. And she's like, I'll show you true pain. She breaks out of this. Or I say she punishes Ooh. this nigga. Ooh. She breaks out of a torture chamber. You know, you're building yeah. you're in a torture chamber genjutsu. You break out of it because you feel no pain. And then yeah. you punish the nigga that put it on. Yeah, <sighs> these niggas are built different. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I think the most embarrassing thing that happened though was Kakashi, bro. Can we talk about Kakashi for a second? Yeah. Why is this nigga built up to not be a bum, but he's a bum. bum? Like, bro, even Pain knew this nigga's name, yo, and his title, his epithet, yo. He's like, oh, yeah. it's the copy ninja. I've heard so much about you, like, bro. The fact and that you're world renowned, but you're still a bum makes no sense. Body Can somebody explain this to me? This nigga stopped being cool after Haku and Zabuza. Literally, bro. You got over a thousand ninjutsu. You use like four. That is. Nigga, where are your juices at? That's that is even true. Sense. Nigga talking about I'm here to save the villain. No, you that is true. Folded. This nigga pain folded you. Kakashi, you literally did nothing. He beats you so bad. You yeah. had to hallucination. You started talking to your dad. Your dad smoked himself. Your dad is dead right now. Yeah. He beat you into a dream where you were talking to a dead the relative. Thing bro, the this Kakashi at the campfire smiling at his dad. This nigga beat the mask off you damn near. Bro, like, oh my God, yo. He and then one a from, a, from, a, from a, an Kakashi, off screen. Yo, he really was down bad, yo. This nigga did you so greasy. Guy would have been tight if he was here seeing this shit, bro. Because I wouldn't have went out like that. I'm just saying, niggas be always talking about Kakashi over God. Yeah, when? When he got a fucking eye given to him in the final war? Like, because right? besides that, my man Guy is folding this nigga. Anyways, at this point, after he folds Kakashi like a motherfucking lawn chair, yeah. he flies up in the air. Don't know right how he's doing again, that. So we are. We seen something in the sky floating above the leaf village. And he says, now the world shall know shall pain. No and pain. he uses oh, this almighty, almighty push attack. Push. I'm gonna tell you, this nigga literally flattened and destroyed I don't the entire even know leaf village with this one attack. Bro, I am that not power over is that this strong. This nigga is different, bro. Talk like, about holy oh my shit. Push. Bro, at this point, though, I'm like, all oh, he hope left is lost, a bro. crater. Of the, the, the holy the village is for the village. Village. Now out here using slugs trying to heal people. She got Dang. this car going healing people up and shit. Like, bro, what is going on? She got these nasty ass slugs, bro. If one of them slugs touch me, bro, I'm gonna be like, nope. I'm gonna just heal naturally. Don't even touch me. Don't heal me, nigga. Like, bro, that that shit is gross. Wow. Bro, look like the slug from the slurm episode of Futurama. Like, uh. I'm tired of this. Shit. But anyways, let's meet the new. There. At this point, I'm like, all oh, hope is lost, bro. And then Sakura does the most useful thing she's ever done in the story. She yells, yells for Naruto. Name. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I know my Sakura fans are mad right now, bro. But come on, you know I got to slander Sakura at least once ago because she literally did nothing this whole arc. But that's neither near there. Uh, like, she, well, she did save this one little girl though, and her mom. What was that? A little boy and her mom. I can't remember, but she did save okay. them. So I like, I'll give her points for that. Something. Guess, yeah, like, she did something. Come on, yeah, but how would Nada gonna be fighting pain to you not though? Like, why wasn't you out there? I mean, yeah, he not, not he, he not stepped up, up for Shunai. love. I can't recall. Hold on. I don't know what the Bubba. soccer was doing, but that shit had me tight. But anyways, it don't even matter. So she goes, Naruto! And we hear the infamous And we just see all the toads here with this nigga Naruto. Yes. He's mastered his sage mode, bro. This nigga Naruto is so drippy in that red rope. Bro, yes. still to this day one of my favorite Naruto fish, bro. I'm not oh, lie, yes. That red robe is I crazy, bro. It. Standing up looking like his motherfucking master. And Jirai then and with the three toes. Top he got all of them with him, bro. He got the one toe with the samurai yep. swords. Uh, the other Gama one with the big ass staff joint. Gama Gama Ken and Gama Tatsu. You know what I'm saying? With the pipe and all that. He got and then Gama like, going crazy. Bro, let yes, me tell you sir. how this fight is one of the most famous and infamous fights in all of Naruto. Because it's famous for the fact that it's literally one of the best fights in the series. It's oh, yeah. It's because it gets brought up so much that people are just like, oh my God, nigga, like, stop talking about it. There's certain fights in Naruto, like Pain versus Naruto, Obito versus Kakashi, Rock Lee versus Gara, that yeah. people talk about so much all that it makes time. them mad when you mention them on any type of social media. But, bro, this shit is fine. It is what it is. It anyway, really was. When this nigga Naruto shows up, I'm like, okay, he's about to get the work in, niggas. He straight punishes one of the pains as soon as he makes an entrance. Hit him whatever. Yeah, like, yeah, bam. bam. I'm like, oh yeah, Ooh. it's lit for niggas. This nigga Naruto starts fighting, right? He's using the frog Kumite. Yo, his Taijutsu is on fucking point. Yeah, and he's fighting a big dude. Hmm, <laughs> weave. 
Weave. Big dude grabs his foot. He flips off. Kicks. That was and then he just so lands on his sick. Shit. I'm like, yo, this nigga's different. Like, so he actually like, picked up no, some I legit Ijutsu. And this Jutsu. nigga absorbs chakra, you feel me? That wasn't so a just blind attack is not gonna straight work. up He's like, beating right, you I mean, up. This nigga with attack, he can't even see. Naruto goes to punch this nigga. Yeah. And the sage chakra I'm still is trying like to... protruding off his arm. Yeah. And he blasts this nigga in the cheek. Yeah! Jeez. How do you deck somebody like, oh and not God. even hit him, bro? You know a nigga is cold when he punches you and you think that he deliberately missed, but bro, he literally did it on purpose so he could hit you with the fucking after effects of the punch. Come on, that bro. is this crazy. Not so and let's not forget about the frogs that's with him, bro, because they was punishing the summoning jutsus. Dogs trying to fight him. He hey, hey, cut, cut. You feel me? Got him. Smacked him with the stab. Boom. Bow. The bird cut him. And Jiraiya's yep. dog falls on the one nigga. The, uh, the Cerberus dog falls on his head for real. This nigga sitting on his. Dog for real. Yeah. Shit, animal cruelty, nigga. This is nigga with a butt bump. This nigga hit this dog like he's rocking. Rocky. Rocky. Nigga. Damn. Wow. They punish these niggas, yes. bro. I'm not gonna lie. At this point, I'm like, okay, yo. <laughs> it ain't too much that y'all can do. Like, what are y'all about to do? But the problem with this fight was not that Naruto was underpowered or oh, he wasn't strong man. enough. It's just so many powerful enemies that it was like an attrition fight. And eventually, these niggas that can't feel pain and are getting like infinite chakra, not infinite chakra, but a lot of chakra from Nagato. Yeah, it's like literally they're reserved. In some contraption. And the reserves are just God, being consistently dumb, filled bro, up. Talk no juicy shit, but hey, that's neither here or there. When you're fighting somebody that you have a limit and they basically don't, eventually you get tired, and that's what happened with Naruto here. It wasn't that he wasn't strong enough. This nigga was just no, going it for was, eight yeah, rounds. It was like, a I limit, lie, bro. This nigga Naruto. <sighs> Like, somebody needed to throw him in Gatorade. I felt bad for my man, Joe, but, but it's cool, though, because he was smart. He had two Shadow Clones getting nature energy for him and all that. I'm like, yeah, yep. nigga, different. So they that was smart. And we get to see the Roshan Shuriken for the first yes. time, bro, because he's tight at this nigga Nagato. I keep calling him Nagato because it is, but pain, you know what I meant. But right. anyways, the Roshan Shuriken is the move that he was working on before with the different, you know, attributes when he was yeah, talking to Kakashi talking and about stuff. his uh, going to lie, bro, nature. this nigga just spams the same moves the whole story, bro. Roshan he really God, does. Roshan Shuriken, Shadow Clone, Jusu, bro. Sometimes that's it. Sexy, sexy Jutsu, Jutsu. maybe, nigga. That's like, it. But, but, but it's basically those three, bro. He throws the Russian shirt again. I'm but, not going to lie. And, shit gets and you want to know what's really funny? A lot of people like to say, oh, Sasuke is better than Naruto because he's got like only like three Jutsu. Well, let's be real. All right. Outside of, you know, the, the Renegon and the, the Mangekyo Sharingan, what else did Sasuke do? Chidori. Fire style, fireball Jutsu. His sword. He used, you know, Kirin once. Sasuke doesn't have that much jutsu either. And with the fact that he has the Sharingan, and of course afterwards the Renegon, he has access to all of that shit because of his blood. If Sasuke was not in Uchiha, he wouldn't have any more jutsu than Naruto does. Let's, let's just be honest. It would pretty much be three jutsus here, three to four jutsus here versus three to four jutsus here, at least. So let's just be honest. <laughs> Hold you, bro. But this is one part that was mad fire, right? He turns the Russian shuriken into him. Like, it's like a like a clone fake out. So he throws it. It starts getting absorbed, but it's really him. It's he, a, yeah, it's a clone. And he rocks the nigga, bro. I yeah, he bro, slam That's one of the coldest dunk. things ever. It's like, you remember he used to do it with the actual shuriken. He would throw it, and it was him. He did it with the Russian shuriken this time, though. My nigga Naruto was growing right before yeah, he, eyes. He, he grew up point, he so much. He was ninja in the village, bro. Like, the only one I really could compare with this nigga was, like, guy, maybe. But guy would need, like, Probably like seven, eight gates for that. Like, right, let's come on. Oh, I gotta come on over clean. But this nigga pain is a menace though, because the entire time he's fighting Naruto, he's giving this nigga straight lectures, bro. Like, and I don't mean like corny lectures that yeah. you're just like, okay, bro, shut up. Like, no, these are lectures you should be listening to, bro. Chakra. He's talking to this nigga Naruto's soul, literally. He's telling him about how his village got fucked up in this war between the Leaf Village and the Fire Village, and he gives the infamous speech where he talks about the same cycle of hatred Damn. that's been caused here, and how his justice and Naruto's Ooh. justice. Are both valid. And I'm just like, yo, I still that's real think shit. That that's we never painful. look at the perspective of other people. We always looking at the perspective of the main character. So we think like, okay, you fucking with Naruto. Well, I don't fuck with you. But Pain is like, look, man, I know that you right, but I'm also right, nigga. And I'm right. like, yo, nigga, you was right. Like, you feel me? Right, 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 and all that. But uh, nigga, you valid. Like his village.
just got fucked up too. It just really like the did. did. So he used his sense of justice like Naruto will try to use his sense of justice. His point but of Naruto view. Is not trying to hear that, bro. And eventually he gets these motherfucking same black rods in his back, just like his man Jiraiya, bro. Yep. These motherfucking chocolate Six. things. He starts pouring his chocolate into him and all that. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? This man Naruto down bad on his Damn. belly, bro. Through his knees and everything, man. be behind me and be in that position. Oh, but, but that's the thing. <laughs> this is how you know pain is a demon, though, right? Because Hinata jumps in this and confesses to Naruto that she loves him. And I'm like, oh, yeah. that's cute. <sighs> oh, boy. And then gets fucking punished, bro. Pain literally is punishing no Hinata mercy. Bro, all throughout this battlefield. Almighty push. Boom. Bow. Devastating pool work. Wait. <laughs> or devastating pool. What is that shit called, bro? When he pulls him in? I forgot, yo. No, anyways, it's he's uh, the pool attack. Bring him in. Boom. Freaking, what is and that he called? He ends up doing this Almighty push, push at one point. And she flies into the air and falls down, bro. And I don't Naruto's remember yelling, the pool one. Hinata. Hinata. She's getting up, dragging herself. This is looking like a Call of Duty Black Ops 2 zombie and shit. She's uh, dragging herself and he stabs this bitch yeah. with one of them rods bro and when Bam. i tell you that this nigga naruto was not having he that snapped. oh my god bro this nigga naruto he literally started spazzing snapped. bro you just see qb chakra instantly and i'm like oh shit here, here we, we go, go again, again. Oh, my cj shit from san andreas like bro, d d d d d bro I'm tired i think it's called gravitational it, bro. all was carry every time naruto fights somebody and he's not strong enough karama 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 i'm like bro this last time karama had to step in and intervene he ended up losing his life in boruto like bro come on Damn, yeah. There. Anyway, so this nigga Karama takes over because Naruto is mad, bro. And this nigga Pain is still talking heavy to him. He's like, do yeah, you do you hate me now? Are you mad at me? Bro, fighting <laughs> this nigga. And I ain't gonna lie. This is when, like, the budget must have went down because, yo, the animation here was some of the goofiest shit Yeah, it kind of was bro. goofy. Yeah, Pain looking like he was in Beetlejuice, bro. He had his stretched out face. Like, yeah. Bro, what's going on here? That was... Bro, I don't know if it was the CGI or what. I have this nigga no idea. Now. Every time Naruto would punch him, his face made whole waves. It looked like you smashed. I think they had to do stomach. it because like, bro, of how much was lie. going on so at they one time. Naruto's using four tails, then six tails. And I ain't gonna lie, his six tails is mad fast. He had a skeleton on his back and all that. He is teleporting, basically. <laughs> but this nigga is not playing, bro. He ends up fighting back. And I'm like, yo, how can Pain lose? Like, six tails ain't enough. What the fuck is yeah, and, and Pain and held his happened, own. Bro, this man used the devastating planetary... Yeah, planetary dev devastation. Planetary devastation. You know what I knew? I knew it, nigga. You feel me? I just think about it. You know what I'm saying? I feel but you, bro. Devastation. This nigga starts using all the rubble around him, and he makes this big ass ball and yeah, just it's like freaking a freaking asteroid. I'm not gonna lie. He talking about the Sage of Six Pass made the moon. This is nothing. I'm like, nigga, nothing. Nigga, you are bleeding from your nose and mouth right now, bro. This is definitely something. Nigga caused internal bleeding to himself because he tried to make a big ass planet. And I'm not gonna lie, it worked. This nigga Naruto it really did. His tails inside yes. of this shit. I'm like, bro, what is going on? He damn he basically near went the damn full QB at this point. Naruto's drrr, he's shooting fire out his mouth. I'm like, bro, what the uh, fuck? Nigga, you're a dragon or a fox? Like, what is going on? Like, he ain't quite the Mozilla Firefox logo yet. You know what I'm saying? But he was getting there. Right. This man, you be inside telling him, take the seal off. Let me destroy all things that you hate. Yeah, all things let me, that let me get him out of here. I'm like, oh, this nigga is manipulating and gaslighting my nigga Naruto right now. And Naruto was actually about to pull the seal off. And then the fourth Hokage showed up. And I ain't gonna lie, he's one of the drippiest niggas, bro. Minato, that's a drippy ass nigga. Yeah. Though, I ain't gonna lie. The most he dangerous shows up and has ninja the whole talk ever. Naruto. I'm not gonna talk about that because that was a real, like, a emotional moment and i can't really make fun of that too much like you right. know what i mean Nigga, at least your dad love you. Like, it is what it is. My dad went to go get milk. <laughs> came back, though. He came back from oh, he, getting milk. He, oh, he came me? back? But then he told my mom he didn't want to be a dad and left. <laughs> I ain't going to lie. But anyways. Damn. I'm upset. But anyways, this nigga near over there. So at this point, though, Naruto, you feel me, uses talk no jutsu against this nigga pain. And I'm not going to talk about talk that either, no except jutsu. for the small part where I do want to rant about it. Because it's like, okay, talk no jutsu is annoying in Naruto. It does happen a lot. And like, it everybody does. hates it. I'm not going to lie. But it's like, I get it. It made sense. It's like when those things that make sense but the execution makes you mad because it's just like bro yeah all talk that action everything and, and then like, yeah, nigga, you, you talk just about talk <laughs> Anyways, talk no jutsu, and everybody got brought back to life, bro. It was that's just work, bro. This basically was just Dragon Ball Z moment, bro. This was a <laughs> I wish everybody was. was alive moment, basically. Like I, I ain't gonna lie, bro. It like, like, was. like shout out, you feel me? You know what I'm saying to my nigga um Toriyama and all that. You know what I'm saying we put Dragon Ball on this channel, but come on, yo, yo. Also, editor, uh, make sure you don't put any Dragon Ball clips uh, right there at that part because I am not trying to deal with Toei bitch ass, bro. Like, I know nine, that's but, um, right. You can put like a logo or something. And you feel me? You know Toei will. But anyways, after the talk of Jusu, <laughs> Toei will demonetize 
you in a heartbeat. The in the village, bro. But, 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 but that doesn't change the fact that this nigga Pain literally brought the pain, bro. And one failed swoop, this nigga killed Jiraiya, yep. a legendary Sani, yep. killed to the Leaf Village, destroyed the entire destroyed Leaf Village. Destroyed it, yeah. Damn near killed Naruto in the process. Yeah. And killed Kakashi. Yeah. And damn near killed like everybody else, bro. Like a lot of major characters got bodied. But one thing that y'all have to realize, yo, that the cycle of hatred is real. And that nigga Pain was talking heavy. He was talking real facts. But what he needs to do is talk to the community about the cycle of these Bubba. Nakatsuki cosplays. Because I'm goddamn tired of it. Next nigga I seen in the Nakatsuki <laughs> cosplay, I'm about to almighty put something on that nigga. You feel pause. That was crazy. But anyways, that nigga Pain is the GOAT. Well, there you have it. That is just the reminder that Pain is black air force energy like i said i still to this day remember them fighting naruto versus pain that was quite literally the most action that you would see in the whole damn series to that point and he was right about the animation i believe <laughs> Now, giving giving them okay props to this, I'm thinking that like because there was so much going on, maybe they had to dial it back a little bit. I don't know. I mean, we've seen high, you know, we've seen fast paced stuff in like Fire Force and you know Demon Slayer and and all of these different uh different shows, and, and they can keep it up. One Piece. They can keep it up real well. So I don't know what the hell was going on with that animation shift up, but it was a bit weird and it gave some of the greatest pauses and face moments ever that I'd ever seen. But I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. If you did, why not leave the video a like? Let me know what you think down in the comments below. Leave some recommendations for future reactions. And if you haven't already, why not consider subscribing? Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of this mayhem. Until next time, I appreciate all of you for watching. Like and subscribe for more, for I will continue to make these videos for many moons. Stay safe out there, and never forget to holla at your bear. Peace out.